In the anti-cheat video I said if I get 300 subs I will post the script. So I am posting it and showing you how to set it up. First, join the Discord server in the description. If you do go to channel models then find the message for anti-cheat then clicking the create.roblox.com link for it. Once you're here get the model. Once you have the model, go to your Roblox game and to the toolbox. After your eyes are broken from looking at cringe models in the toolbox, go to the four boxes button at the top. You should see a square called anti-cheat. Drag the box I just showed you to the base plate or game. And you will see this. Press OK. Open Explorer in the View tab and you should see a folder called Anti-Cheat. Open Game Settings and go to Security. Click the switch and you should see a warning at top, it's OK just press Save. Go back to Explorer and open Anti-Cheat after you're in Anti-Cheat Open Server Storage. Go to your Discord server and click the name of it. Make sure you own the Discord server or have administrator permissions. After that, you should see a drop-down menu select Server Settings. Once you open Server Settings, on the left side of your screen you should see a variety of options, click Integrations. Click Create Webhook. Click the arrow, then click Copy Webhook URL. Go to webhook.newstargeted.com. Click the Webhook URL text box. Press Ctrl V on Windows or Command V on Mac. Triple click, not double click, the output box. Press Ctrl C on Windows or Command C on Mac. Go to the View tab, then go press Properties that is right next to Explorer. Go back to your Roblox game and press Webhook. Click Value in Properties and paste in the URL you got from webhook.newstargeted.com. Go to the View tab again and press Command Bar. Go to my Discord server again and look at the anti-cheat model message. It should have a replied message below it, copy the code in the code block. Go back to your Roblox Studio and click the command bar at the bottom, paste the load script in there and press enter. Now it's done. Press play and your anti-cheat script will work. If you want to you could remove the testing GUI and starter GUI forward starter GUI. You can see if you have exploiters in your game.